Asian, 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 Asian. We're the first to philosophize. Nice. Unorganized confusion. Yeah. Like Confucius. Or the fat, giggling Buddhist who said life is suffering. And through the centuries, suffering is all Asians did. But in Greece, intellectual chimpanzees were putting things in order. The Ailes put his banana down and said everything's water. Which is dumb. But to tie it all together is what he tried. It's not water, it's fire, said the nigga Heraclitus. And that's the kind of shit that occupied the Athenians. Tying everything together, it's called integration. Pythagoras said everything is numbers in a theorem. But there's more to life than numbers, so no one wanted to hear him. Zeno said there's no such thing as change. He got wrecked, but we know he invented the debate. Or dialectic. When there was democracy, there was Democritus. He was wrong about some shit, but still they call him dad of science. Does the end justify the means? Prosimachus said yeah. But tell that to someone dying for someone else's idea. And that's the fate of Socrates. Convicted for corrupting little boys. And for democracy? He drank fucking poison. The boys in Socrates' class were mostly fake and gay, though. But the first to build a system of philosophy was Plato. He said this world isn't real. But there's a world of forms where everything is perfect. He was fucking wrong. But they thought he was right. So his work was taught and saved. Ironically, which led the West back into a cave. But he paved the way for his student with the system model. Just the realest nigga ever to exist. Aristotle. He wanted explanation for the shit Plato told him. And he wrote it all down. How Plato like a clown? All the bullshit Plato said. Aristotle asked how. His metaphysics still hurts Plato's ass now. Aristotle wasn't perfect. But he gave us laws of logic. Which gave us shit like PlayStation 1 and Apple Watch. All the cool shit you got. Thank Aristotle's mother. Which is more than anybody did back when the words were uttered. Nobody gave a fuck. Yeah, fuck what he was saying. They was busy eating euro. Wrestling naked being gay. Like Epicurus told him. Avoid all pain. The Stoics were like, nah. Too much pleasure is vain. They said be serious. Focus on what you're doing. But they also pushed away the happiness worth pursuing. And the skeptic? Ancient neck, beard, big town. They said you can't know shit. Wrong then. Gay now. As time passed, Plato's influence increased. Philo brought him to the Jews. Enter Christianity. Augustine cemented Plato to the West in written pages. Blazing faith over reason, bringing in the dark ages. And poor Aristotle. Dismissed in his day. No one gave a fuck about his jam. And it was cast away. And his fucking name forgotten. By a world that shit on him. Until he was discovered by... A Muslim? Al Mamun translated him from Greek and began a golden era when religion let you think. But reason was rejected by this guy Al Ghazali, which is probably why Islam today is not too fucking jolly. He decided to try to mix faith and reason was retarded, so he threw the precious work of Aristotle in the garbage. The enlightenment of the Arabs was over and departed, but in Europe Tom Aquinas was like, I'm just getting started. He learned of Aristotle from this Jewish guy Maimonides, and he got it from a Muslim of Eroe. If ever these three religions found common ground, it's in placing reason over faith. Living here and now The sound of reason cut the silence of the middle ages As pages filled with logic scrutinizing God himself And the changes made some clergy nervous But it was too late Cause the dumbest shit they ever did was let the artist paint Human beauty was depicted Love and sex celebrated Life on earth is the standard Heaven could wait and shit And though Christ was the one being painted Religion didn't know it was being defanged and shit That was the renaissance Then came the enlightenment The other Greek philosophers were studied with excitement Now the truth could be discovered by no other means then shit got more divided than the South and North Koreans A group of new philosophers, one of whom was locked Said you can't trust your mind, but your senses and your cock No reality, so don't think too much, you little bitch The philosophers who said this are called empiricists On the other side of this dichotomy of mind and body Descartes and all his niggas said your senses could be naughty You could only trust your mind to know what is and isn't This school of philosophy is rationalism That's when philosophy became a shitstorm Scientists no longer thought philosophy was forum it did Philosophy to spare itself the damage When Rousseau is talking about our true nobility is savage Philosophers of body versus philosophers of mind All misguided but the truth is that the truth they tried to find See they all respected reason They each wanted to have it Then Kant said Reason? Reason is a faggot He modernized Plato's world of forms from before Causing reason and reality itself to go to war He tried to fix the mind-body split but only made it bigger Cause reality requires you to reason my nigga Now that reality and reason were divorced Everyone had to pick one and Whatever cause Trying to understand the world Became a fucking headache Hegel said reality and logic are synthetic Marx pushed reason even farther away In fact he said reality depends on closer to a factory If philosophy ended the age of darkness It was now laying the blueprints for retarded shit Nietzsche loved power and strength But it's not reaching or a stretch Saying he inspired Nazis Superman something that Nietzsche gave us Too bad he saw people as masters and slaves Who are free now in America? Land of Thomas Paine Who brought over the enlightenment from Europe? He explained The right of man is to be free Cause that's his fucking nature When the Germans came no one saw the fucking danger Royce and his boys turned to Hegel for the basics Dewey said your mind doesn't learn shit it creates it Students went to Germany 
me, brought you back and spread it Which is why today's smartest, most retarded shit on Reddit No reason to reason now that nothing could be known Pragmatism said take action and follow your emotion Kids trained to have coherence of a mental patient This was the birth of progressive education Integration no longer required Postmodernism said that your mind could retire Religion made a comeback, tribalism too Cause without reason, there's just feelings and the group Without philosophy, scientists can't resist Oriental mystics claiming their shit is legit Recycled anti-rational, repeating the same motion Alleged men of science invoking their emotions John Rawls said we all should be the same Social justice is morality Philosophy became a game of bullshit and semantics That no one understands And nobody gives a fuck about Except for Ayn Rand The last of the enlightenment She tied mind and body and reality to reason Which is great, except nobody intellectual would give a fuck Professors wouldn't budge They must have their reasons But history will judge School of Rock, yeah! Rock, 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 rock